Hey guys and welcome to a new video. I hope you like the intro. Thanks again to Dum Dum who helped me edit it and I wanted to make this year's Valentine's even more enjoyable for everybody, especially those of us that will probably spend it by watching new Deadpool movies. So I wanted to uh, make a chibi Deadpool for all of you, offering you his eternal love and of course pancakes! Uh, and I'm personally a huge fan of homemade pancakes, American and uh, crepe type we eat in Europe. Well, if you, co if you consider my country Europe. Anyways, um, I hope that you like the little skull details I did for him um, instead of hearts, because we all know Deadpool is a very specific type of guy <laughs> relating to love and all things that go with it. And um, I was trying to make him even more fun by adding a lot of tiny details, but this time I didn't use my uh, 0.1 fine liner. I was using actually that pilot pen with flexible brush tip, and it's very nice for making all kinds of uh, funny and sketch-like um, line art, especially for making thicker lines like you can see me doing right now for stuff that's uh, in Deadpool's hand, well, the, the little batch of pancakes, and of course it's a very great tool for um, drawing <coughs> tiny details, especially uh, since he has such a detailed armor in his movie version. This is actually something I was referencing from the official movie version trailer and photos. And you can find a lot of different Deadpools. You can find like mm, Mado Deadpools. I don't know. I even saw a Gothic Lolita Deadpool uh, recently, and <laughs> he's always changing his costumes or stealing other people's costumes and just having fun with it. Uh, I personally love this character because he's the one character from comic books that realizes he's a character from comic books and he's breaking the fourth wall constantly constantly stealing other characters girlfriends boyfriends uh, property whatever so i really like him as a character and he's just so random and as you can see uh, i was skipping some parts for you to enjoy the process of making that pool even uh, even if you're busy or not being able to sit through the entire video so uh, I decided to ask you guys if you consider uh, that it should be appropriate to release a shorter version of my videos on Fridays and release a longer version on Saturdays so please leave a comment regarding this issue and I will make sure to uh, listen to you guys and make longer videos for everybody who wants to just take a longer look and steal some of the knowledge um, don't worry it's um it's a saying among artists that you steal knowledge for art i always proudly stole it from my teachers from wherever um local billboards and uh, arts art books so it's just a common phrase don't don't take it too seriously and of course while drawing and painting pancakes i became horribly hungry and i had to be stopped from making pancakes as soon as i was finished drawing this so th thankfully uh, to my co-editor today i was able to finish this video on time without eating the pancakes he was offering but uh, when I get rid of him, I'll make some pancakes anyway. Uh, anyway, he has a lot of tiny details I wanted to exaggerate. And uh, especially his little um, clasps and buckles. So when you draw chibis, always make sure you're e either over-exaggerating some of the details or uh, making them super tiny and super uh, small uh, but yet detailed. Uh, it's very important. Especially, it's important for you to remember that uh, things like ankles and uh, elbows are not very visible on chibi characters. And of course, I've used a scalpel. I do not recommend using a scalpel without parents around if you're under the age of 10. Uh, always be careful because even the professionals tend to cut themselves, so make sure you're, you have a cutting mat and that you have all of the 
proper equipment and go slow. I hope you like what you, uh, what you see and um, if you think I should take photos of him in different locations, just give me a comment. And he's done. If you want to download him, please leave a comment below so that I can scan him and make him available for you guys to use and cut out at home. As for all of you who want to learn how to draw manga and chibis, you can always purchase my book Manga Crash Course available in English and French languages online and in your local bookstore. See you guys next time!